everybody, welcome back. I'm about to share with you, I'm on the design team for Tanya Lay Designs. I will link her information down below. But this collection is her March collection. It's called Somebody Loves You. And I was inspired totally by I Am Absolutely Alice. I will also link her information down below to do flat mail. So this is the flat mail I created using Tanya Lay Designs kit. Um, again, I will link it all down below. But I, these are all cutouts. This green is from Maggie Holmes, but all this paper is from the collection. This bunny is from the collection. The bow is from the collection. This picture frame, it actually has a smaller bunny right here and it says Happy Easter, but I covered it up and, and cut and, and printed out one of the bigger bunnies and taped it over, glued it over. Um, but I do, I tend, I have a lot of international friends that I swap with and it gets so expensive. So Alice is like, you know what? I'm gonna bring back flat mail. And it is amazing. This was actually so hard to make because I, I had to make it flat. And it is so hard to layer and embellish and when you have to think, the idea is that you send this in an envelope and it's it's literally $4 instead of $25. So it's awesome. I'm gonna show you what's in here. Um, I'll take it all out and see what goodies are in here. But I have, it. this is a shaker pocket. I've held it, I have it held on with this beautiful clip but it's also holding on a bunch of bags. So I'm gonna take the clip off and then here's her little goodie pocket. I was gonna glue it down, but I'm like, no, you know what? She can just reuse this if she wants. So see, I, I should have backed that because it looks messy on the back, but um, she can reuse this. Again, this is Tanya Lay Designs, her, fit, or her March Somebody Loves You kit. This paper is all from her. I ripped the edges. I used my gold thread and sewed all around the edges. I did three lines this time. Um, this is, these are thickers. I don't know what collection they're from. It says spring, I'm gonna add, it's not fully finished, but the lighting is perfect, so I wanted to video. I'm gonna add some stitching onto these tags, but these are two Target tags. This is a Maggie Holmes tag. And then I gave her this little paper clip. So again, this is flat mail that we're gonna send out. So now that that's off, these are all the bags I'm giving her. So she has one, two, three, four, five bags so so far we have quite a lot of goodies in this one little package this is going to have a little bit more embellishing that i need to finish but i repackaged some of these this paper behind it is um from the collection it has little bunnies and little like chick feet it's really cute these she's also getting i repackaged these are paint chips that are a part of the collection and this is that bunny paper right here that I printed smaller, so it's not as, it's not as, uh, the feet print and the bunnies are not as big. But here's another goodie in here. And this is a die cut. I forget where I got it from. I just got it, somebody on Instagram, and I already forget who, I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> she, I have to look it up, but she told me where to get it from. I could let you guys know if you wanna know, just message me or um, put a comment down below and I'll, I'll, I'll hunt it down. But I did a little bit of stitching on the bag here. These are also stickers from Michaels that I rebagged or from Hobby Lobby. And then this is the flat mail package. I took an envelope, just, or excuse me, a file folder, and I cut it and cut it smaller. It was a little bit longer. So then I was left with these two pieces and I just sewed it together to make my little pocket. But I think it came out super cute. It was really hard for me to do. If you guys are up for a challenge, I challenge you to make flat mail because it is very difficult to get creative and have it be flat so it can go through as a letter. I would love to see what you create and um, I can't wait to make more of these flat mails. So check Tanya Lay Designs out. I will link her information. I will link Alice's information. And if you wanna know where I got this bunny die from, just let me know and I'll, and I'll try to track it down. Okay, thanks for watching.